do this vlogging, especially early in the morning when you look rough, but this is what I look like in the morning. I am going to take Spark on a walk this morning. I already watered the plants upstairs, so when I come back, I'll water the ones downstairs. Uh, I want to go out to Centro to find the bakery that had that donut. It was so good. And um, then I need to come back and do some work and do some prep work, especially from our meeting yesterday with the ladies about the project we're working on. So that is my plan as of right now. It's 8.45 in the morning and Spark woke me up at 6.30. Oh, I am so sleepy. But when you have a little puppy, because he's not even a year yet, you have to uh, tend to their needs. I'm still in the process of trying to train him um, and that's not going very well. This is the little guy who likes to wake people up at six in the morning. Hey, Spreddy. Oh, what is that? Are you talking back? I am back home from the walk. It was, I could have took the camera, but it's too much to manage with him and trying to make sure he doesn't run out. Thankfully, I have um, this like waistband leash that I got from the breeder and I love it because he can kind of freely walk but he's connected so it's kind of hands-free and it also teaches him to walk with me um, so this is what I walk him with now it makes life so much better than using the regular leash all right I'm um, on my way I'm walking to the bakery um, they close it too I was going to go with Bobby of Aging Grateful, but she has um, workers at her house. But once I leave the bakery, I'm going to City Market because they have the incense that I really like. I'm gonna go and pick up some of those and um, then make my way back home. bakery is just up the street right over there so I'm gonna go ahead and cross I hate walking down this street which is Sterling Dickerson because like right now there's no shade and I don't like that um, later in the evening one side will be more shaded than the other so it makes it easier to walk not as hot when it's kind of the bakery before no when it's like I don't see any donuts. Unfortunately, I did not see any donuts. And I'm not exactly certain if that was the bakery from the Saturday market. So I might need to go back to the Saturday market to confirm the bakery. The only other bakery I can think of is Luna de Queso. So uh, I can probably try that one on the way home because it's not too far from City Market.
even cross the street because there's definitely more shade over here. Oh, it's a huge temperature change. I'm gonna go to Luna de Queso and see. It's gonna stop by this bakery over here to see if it had those donuts. Listen, the great lengths I'm currently going to find these donuts, that should tell you how good they are because they were really, really good. Oh my goodness, it's so windy. My hat blew off my head, that's how windy it is. Unfortunately. Now I'm really off to City Market. I'm going to go there, get my incense, and then go to um, call an Uber to go home. Because I don't want to walk back in the sun. Let me stop in the shade real quick because it's really hot one thing about this whole vlogging lifestyle is getting used to people looking at you because obviously I look weird talking into a camera so that's something to get used to but I will walk that way to go to city market anymore I'm gonna have to I still have the box at home so I'm gonna have to order it I'll try this one but I'll buy two um, it's 42 pesos for this incense which is not bad considering I bought hand rolled incense which were like this big for 150 pesos so I'll go with this one I'm also going to get two of these. So, I got Nag Champa and Cy Flora. The box smells good, but I don't know if that's the actual incense. We'll see. Now I want some diffuser refill for the house. Mm, this smells good. It's a candle. It's fruity. It smells good. I really would like to have some sort of like enameled pot. It doesn't have to be like her set because. I don't know if I could feel comfortable shelling out 8,000 pesos for something like that. I'm good with a knockoff. So this is a smaller one. It's nice. It's 6,200 pesos. Which is like, what's that? A uh, conversion in my head. What is the conversion? Three hundred dollars, I think. I like these. I just, I just can't spend that money. 
this Le Crescent is more expensive than the current camera that I'm holding. This camera is like 5,300 pesos on Amazon. Maybe I should check Amazon for this. Maybe I'll get lucky. Oh, this yellow is pretty. Okay, let me get out of here. These are really pretty. I love how colorful these are. grocery bag. I would be happy with the quality stainless steel pot, but they don't really have it. And I really want to get away from non-stick pans and pots. I would much rather just have cast iron or stainless steel. So I'm debating on leaving here and going to the restaurant supply store to see if they have something that I could get that is relatively inexpensive compared to Le Crescent. We'll see. All right, so I'm done. I'm gonna go check out. I don't have much. <clears throat> and I'm ready to get out of here, get my car. I think I'm just gonna go home because I'm kind of tired. The sun really took it out of me. So I'm gonna go home. I might go to Blimey another day. Oh. Let's go. Plus, I have to pick up something from our mailbox. It's, what is today? Wednesday. So, this is what I'm doing. I'm back heading towards Sterling Dickerson. Whenever I'm walking, I always give dogs like a wide berth because I just don't know their temperament. I haven't had any issues with dogs since I've been here, but you know, you never know. Never know what a dog is feeling that day. <laughs> there are stray dogs here, mostly on the main strip where all the restaurants are. That's where you'll see all of the stray dogs. Need to find some shade. <clears throat> Back on Sterling Dickerson. One thing I can say is if you're going to be in a sunny place, get an umbrella. It's a game changer.
where do you want to sit? Right. Um, here is fine for me. Yep. wondering it takes about 20 minutes to get to the most central not most central but central part of San Miguel from where we live Buenos dias I'm going today is Saturday and I'm going to the Saturday market always find the shade where you can because that heat is brutal Unfortunately, I'm gonna have to go directly to the bakery. She's right there. She's getting food too. Fresh and Chopsticks. Where's your car? Right by the hotel? Down a little further. Where's the other place? Will you walk there? It's, we walked last week, but it's, it's far. Like, that's a good, you know where Francesco 
How's that? You can also go to the Francesco's. Stop by another market. Hmm. Oh. Hola. Hi. Hola. Shower water. This is really pretty. Nice meeting you. Nice meeting you. This is really pretty. That looks a lot like Mexico City. Yeah. That is gorgeous. Hmm? Oh, look. Mm -hmm. This isn't always like this. Okay. Usually it's just open, but lately the doors have been closed, so. Sisters. Oh, her sisters. Yeah, her mom. Okay. Yeah. That's neat. <laughs> yes. Mm -hmm. See. Pretty dress. The orange, the like, yeah. 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 It's cute. Oh yeah. Where are they at? Estancia. Estancia de Coral. This is like the main reason why I love living here is being able to just happen upon people and markets and yeah. things like that. It's just surprise. I, my, I was, uh, I was See? Good afternoon. Today is Easter. This should be the end of this weekly vlog. Not much was happening. This is just everyday life. Um, I need to do like some sort of uh, weekly reset to get myself back on focus for the next week. Right now, I've already cooked yesterday or the day before, so I have leftovers. I'm not cooking. And did my hair. Good to go. Mm -hmm.